what is up everybody and welcome back to the wildest channel on youtube we have an amazing vlog planned for you guys today and as you can already see we are here at petco so we are going to grab one of the puppies who you may have seen in the last video and i'm going to bring him in let him pick out a toy we're going to get some other treats for the puppies at home as well as king saturn and zaza who you guys might have seen in the other videos uh, Princess Zaza actually came here and stole a toy from Petco. I'll put the link so you guys can go back and watch that video. It is absolutely adorable. I have no idea what the puppy is going to do. This is going to be his first time out of the house coming to a pet store. He's 12 weeks old, officially fully vaccinated. So we're super excited to bring him here uh, and see what he does. Before we get too far into the video, make sure that you guys click that subscribe button. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and comment down below if you guys have any suggestions on what we should do in upcoming vlogs. Stay tuned. I'm about to go get the cutest thing that you guys have ever seen. Hercules! <laughs> Hercules! Say hi to YouTube, Hercules! Mwah. This is my big boy, Hercules! And we are gonna head on inside and see what types of adventures we get into. Come on! Hercules have officially made it to the first puppy section in Petco. This is going to be the beginning stages of puppy toys that you'll buy and we came and we stocked up on these when we first had Hercules litter but we are dealing with XL American Bully puppies so toys like this just are not going to cut it. He is 12 weeks old now and he's literally going on 35 pounds already so we are going to have to adventure through the store and find him a little bit tougher toys because on this wall behind me, even these big calm ones, they only go up to 30 pounds. So we're gonna go adventure and let's see what else we can find. Hercules is way ahead of me. So we're also here to get Hercules some edible chew toys, not just play toys. This way he can keep his jaws busy as he is teething. It's very enriching for the young puppies to have things like rawhide to chew on However, we do not use rawhide in our program. So this is an awesome section. Petco has a lot of different rawhide alternatives and natural treats that are extremely digestible. And that is the problem with rawhide and why we don't like it because it's gonna be, especially with a big dog, they're gonna rip off a big piece and it's gonna be really hard for them to digest that. So let's see what Hercules wants. What are you finding, Hercules? So the first thing that I want to show you guys is the Field Crest Farms Nothing to Hide. This is one of the best rawhide alternatives. It comes in different flavors, chicken, beef, you smell it. And there's actually some rolls down here. I'm going to see if Hercules likes one of these. Hercules, look. Oh, he definitely does. So this is probably going to go in the cart. Maybe Hercules will chew it up while we're here hanging out. I'm gonna go ahead and take the wrapper off of this for Hercules. And we will pay for that at the counter since he absolutely loves it. You're a good boy. 
Hercules jaws are just getting strong enough for these types of treats. So this is his first time having one of these rolls and he definitely loves it. I think I'm gonna get a package to take home for the puppies. While he enjoys this, I just wanna tell you guys a little bit more about uh, some of the other treats that you can buy as rawhide alternatives. Where is it going? <laughs> So this is from uh, my favorite brand, Nyla Bone. The healthy edibles are great because they're just like the Nyla Bones, but the dogs can actually swallow and eat it. The Nyla Bones are great. They're made out of nylon and the dogs can't rip off pieces bigger than a grain of rice as long as you get the right size for your dog. Um, but these are awesome for power chewers because they get to chew it and they also get the reward of a treat that they can swallow that tastes nice and good for them. So. I'm gonna try to find ones here. They have puppy ones, but the puppy ones only go up to 15 pounds. And once again, when you are dealing with your extra large American bully, make sure that you guys check the weight sizes on the back of the product so that you get the right one for your dog. You love it, Hercules? Hercules, you going back for seconds? likes that so much I'm gonna go ahead and get another pack so that we can bring home one for his brother and sister at home we gotta find you a toy we are gonna pick out a toy but it's not just for Hercules Hercules has a brother and sister at home and I want to find something that all three of them can play with what do you think I don't know if this is gonna make it through the tug of war test I think you guys are gonna shred it to pieces. You like him? You like him? So let's see if we can find a little bit of a tougher toy than this cuddly baby. That way they can get their teeth on it and they can all play tug of war together. I don't know about you guys, but our puppies definitely love the toys that crinkle like this. So I'm thinking that this one is a great choice so far. You like it? Which one do you like better? You big lazy boy. You big lazy boy. <laughs> a strong boy toy. You need a strong boy toy. After going through the toy section, it seems like Hercules has decided on one of these two. Both of them are great options because they don't have stuffing in them. So even if they are able to rip through, and both of them seem really durable, even if he was able to rip through and play with the cardboard, uh, there's not going to be any stuffing inside, which is better because he is still a puppy and we don't want him eating any of the stuff that may be inside. Hercules and I have officially made it to the second stage of puppy toys. So a lot of these are for adult dogs, but you saw at the puppy section our weight limit is already over Hercules' weight limit. So we're going to check some of these out and see if we can find a slightly denser one, but still soft enough for Hercules' teething puppy teeth. Ooh, that one looks nice with the little nubs on it. The nubs are great. It's going to get in there on his gums. So I took a couple options off of the wall so that we can kind of experiment and see which one is going to be best for him. And I just want to show you guys, this is the puppy toy. So that's what you're going to get for most of your puppies. But it's up to 15 pounds. And like I said, Hercules is about to be 35. So we need to find something that's still soft enough that he can teeth but hard enough that he's not going to be able to rip a chunk off. How's this one? Over it. Um, he's going to have a lot of fun at home playing with these toys, especially with all of his litter mates. I really like this one because it's still a softer rubber. Um, they're going to be able to get their mouths around it, but there's no way they're going to be able to rip a chunk of this off. This one is literally for up to 35 pounds. So this one is a no-go as well. All right, we've got this one. This one looks like it could be a winner. Um, it's not too hard, I can feel it here, and it goes up to 50 pounds. What do you think? Boring. <laughs> we have one more here, let's see. Uh, this one is only recommended for dogs up to 35 pounds, and that is why I just wanna stress to you guys, when you're going shopping for your puppies and for even your bigger dogs, especially if you do get an XL American Bully or any Bully breed, check the sizes, check the weight on the back of your toys so that your dogs cannot rip them up. 
completely destroy them, waste the money and time you invested, and you don't want it to get a hold of a big chunk and swallow it. So that being said, it seems like we have two winners. We're gonna get the dinosaur and we're gonna get the little donut, but that is not all that we came here for. So Hercules, are you ready to go see what else we can find? He's being such a good boy. Hercules, do you know where we are? Does it smell like food? Does it smell like food? We also have to restock on puppy food today while we are here at Petco and they carry our favorite brand of pet food, Akana. So that is still what Hercules and his litter mates are on. It has three different types of protein, which is really awesome for raising young pups because it gives them a balance in their diet and adjusts them to other protein as they're growing up. So this has turkey, chicken, and fish in it. And then the puppies also get a variety of raw food. I'm gonna make a video very soon showing you guys how I create the raw puppy chow. So make sure you stay tuned for that. But first I need to get a big old bag of this. So when we head home, we can feed all the pups. Oh gosh, Hercules. I'm gonna need a cart for this. You ready? Let's go. Everything that we came here for and Hercules had such a good time my big calm confident boy so let's head to the checkout and see what the damage is that's a good boy that's a good boy Hercules you having fun Hercules formula you're just gonna spray it on their pee or on their poo and it's gonna clean up all of that stinky stuff um, and get it out of your house we have already started potty training with Hercules and he is doing absolutely phenomenal but with younger puppies and for accidents you definitely want to keep a bottle of this around Boy, are you leave? Do you want a little treat? Oh boy. Thank you, you like those? I just gave Hercules just one of these little tiny training treats um, since he likes them so much I'm just gonna get a small scoop because we are doing training with the puppies at home uh, and they seem like they're gonna be great because of how tiny they are good boy Ready to 
adventure make sure that you guys subscribe to the channel so that you can see more videos as hercules continues growing up with us but remember hercules is available and he's looking for a loving home if you guys are interested in bringing this big boy home and having him be a part of your family make sure you head over to instagram i'm gonna drop the link down below it's at jungle queen canine you guys can see that right here and go give us a follow uh, you can adopt Hercules as well as his sister. And we're going to be making some more videos this week of Hercules and his litter mate. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe, like, leave a comment down below, and let me know if you guys want to bring Hercules home. Stay wild, you guys.